Hello everyone, this is Guy from Deco.cx and today we're launching version 2.0 beta of our web editor and I wanted to show you some of the new features that we have been working on. So let's start with creating a new site. Uh, I'll use the blog templates, we have some new templates here. The best thing about this new version is it's super fast to create a new site. This takes around 5 seconds now, before it was like 5 minutes and you start with this blank website uh, which you can edit however you want using JSX, uh, Dino, TypeScript and Tailwind. Uh, this is the stack that we're currently using and we're very happy with it. So for example, let's change a bit, little bit of the stacks. Uh, let me put this to fit so we can see how it looks on desktop. And I'll change this text here to hello product hunt. So this is nice, but what I wanted to show you is how do you create this form, right? So I will come here and I'll click this go to code button and you see it has created a new tab here for me, a new space with the preview of the section. I'll hide the menu here for us to have a little more space. And you see this is um, a React, or React, actually a Preact component uh, using Tailwind. Um, of course I can do things like BG Green 100 here and it just works. But what I really wanted to show you is one of the greatest features that we have in this product is that you can just export some interface and this becomes an editable form for your business user, for your content creator. So for example, I'll add here a new prop called show all and let's say it's a boolean and then first it's going to appear, yeah, here, you see? And now I'm going to just uh, receive this on my code here. Let's say this is true if I don't say anything. And let's guard this component, this entire component under this. So what happens now is if I untoggle this, boom, we don't have the component. And if I toggle this, we have the component. So this is, um, quite amazing in my opinion. Uh, I love this feature. It's very easy to create an editable component. We also have a deco pilot here that you can edit using GPT, you know, edit using a prompt or create from an image. This is pretty great too. Um, it, it really helps to get started with, you know, a, a more complicated component. I also wanted to show you some of the SEO new features. So I'll click here in SEO and you see we have this beautiful little preview here of all types of platforms, uh, very convenient. So if I come here and change this to product hunt, yeah, it changes everywhere and I can see how it's going to look. Uh, another very interesting thing that we have on this new version is team support. So this is changing Tailwind uh, tokens and we're using Daisy Y underneath. So for example, I can come here, I can edit this, I can change any of the colors and I can also come back here, for example, and let's put this one as default. So now that I have set this one as default, what happens when I come back to our page list and I go to home, boom, we have the new page. This is the BG that I put in the code, right? And the rest looks like this. If I click here, we can have the preview for that. Looking quite good. You can also edit, of course, your site, your blog content here. So you can edit authors, uh, categories and posts. And when you open a post, you have a beautiful preview with a, a tip tap editor also. And then you can get this information and use this inside the other pages. Uh, something else that I wanted to show you, I'll need to go to a pro version, a pro site to show you. So let's go here to the home and I will go into the admin side. I just wanted to show you we for the pro sites, uh, we have bundled a plausible subscription. So you have this beautiful web analytics, real time web analytics. Oh, you see, we have uh, one current visitor. That's probably me. <laughs> and another amazing thing that we have bundled is HyperDX with um, complete support for tracing for error logs. So you can come here, for example, let's see this invoke 
uh, you can see precisely the, the path that the request did, you know, what took long. Um, so it's, it's really um, very helpful when you're dealing with a high volume uh, website. So that was it. I hope you enjoyed taking a look at our new product and I'll see you later. And uh, we're looking forward for your feedback and to building this together with you. Thank you. Bye-bye.